Time now for an update from Fox Carolina News and Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rate certified most accurate. Good morning. Time for your news and weather morning update from Fox Carolina. We are working to learn the name of a person killed in a crash along I-385. Many of you reached out to us about this scene near mile marker 23 and Fountain Inn. Troopers say a tractor trailer was traveling south on 385 when it hit a person. Sadly, that victim passed away on the scene. At this time, the coroner has not released their name. Of course, we'll continue to update this story as soon as new details become available. Now to North Carolina, where a community is on high alert as firefighters work to put out a huge fire at a plant in Winston-Salem. People who live near the plant are being asked to leave the area and being told they may have to stay away for two days. With well, the massive fire at the Weaver fertilizer plant starting at some point yesterday, authorities are worried about a possible large explosion because of the materials burning inside. A news briefing is expected to begin at any moment, so we'll be watching that for any new information. Let's get a check of that certified most accurate forecast with Nicole. You know, we are looking at another beautiful day here in the Carolinas. Temperatures just slightly above normal for this time of year. 34 degrees to start in the upstate, reaching 56 this afternoon with plenty of sun and a light breeze. The mountains in the 20s to start get up to 52, so a very similar day to yesterday. Tomorrow brings a small chance at a passing shower and a bit more breeziness to the area. And then late week, Thursday and Friday both turn a little milder. But we have on and off rain coming as as we wrap up this first couple of days of February. So stay tuned to the forecast on the morning news. We're on from 430 until 10 a.m. You can also watch our afternoon and evening newscasts, plus get more on our news app as well as online.